when you start fishing in the wind, um, it's a challenge. It wears you out. You're going to be tired. You know, you're going to be more tired than you would normally. Uh, you're, you know, you're constantly fighting boat control. But it's important to get out and fish in, in the wind because you learn new techniques, new styles, new presentations. You know, like how you would pr present a jerk bait. You know, jerk baits in, in this time of the year, you don't want to fish them too fast. Uh, so if you go downwind fishing with the wind, a lot of times you're just, you know, the bait's not going to be as effective. So you got to kind of fish it into the wind. Conversely, I want to fish with the wind if I. I'm throwing like a spinner bait or a lipless bait or a deep diving crank bait because I can present it better. Come here, fish. Let the boat flip you while you're coming up. Think you're a smallmouth, buddy. I mean, it might be 49 degree water wave, but he, he was an <laughs> acrobat out there. He did. It's unfortunate everybody else didn't get to see him, but he did. He, he's dark like a smallmouth and jumped like a smallmouth. <laughs> that was fun. Well, that move already paid off for me because yeah, that's my first bite of the day. <laughs> so I'm pretty excited about that. <laughs>